So now we come to the Capri car and uh, the place is really the factory floor which is actually the place where work really really happens it's very planned very organized um and goals are accomplished there it is a earthy sign it's ruled by saturn and the stage of life it represents is uh, the early old age and the animals the creatures that represent capricorn are the crocodile um and you all know about the crocodile the crocodile is not flashy uh you know you're probably not even going to notice a crocodile and which kind of works in its favor the crocodile is going to observe it's going to plan it's going to wait it's going to wait it's in no hurry uh but and you know you sometimes you feel that the the crocodile is sleeping because he's he's like a log but no he is completely observing and he is completely planning he's completely strategizing and when the moment is right he's going to get you and he is not going to let you go you could you know in florida they've seen that you can kill us a, a crocodile you can cut chop off his tail or a half part of his body but he will not loosen the grip on you it is that strong grip that they have they are very grounded they're very close to the ground they even very close to the uh you know the surface but uh, they are always um very goal oriented and they will rarely miss you know again the other creature represented is the goat you know the mountain goat actually not just any goat the mountain goat and the goat also is not probably like the you know the the strongest or the fastest or like it doesn't seem to have any very very special feature um you know and yet the mountain goat goat will climb to the very top of the mountain um you know that is the that is the animal you will see on top of the tallest mountains um they are very ambitious uh you know actually there is another third there's a joke among the astrologers that yes it is the crocodile it is the mountain goat but it's also a business suit capricorn can be represented by business suits and uh yeah you do find them in those kind of environments uh they're extremely ambitious they are they can be extremely shrewd they are very hard working they have perseverance that's what a goat has that's what a crocodile has and because of that perseverance the and the organizational skills and the tenaciousness and the practicality the goal setting they are amazing uh um, you know they will meet you know they will like they will be like okay i have to climb this mountain and they will be like i have and this is the step and step and step and step and step and they are able to accomplish something just great see the shadow side of the previous sign is always covered by the next sign so you know in sagittarius you have someone who's looking at the big picture looking at the skies who is looking at the unknown and Capricorn is like okay let's get to the ground let's see what can be actually done uh let's whatever we have whatever is known let us apply it in the best possible way we can and they are very meticulous so meticulous and because they want to apply they do they are materialistic and they are worldly and you know that is also what we uh, some that is also that is needed you know my dad would say that wherever you place a capricorn he, he is going to reach the peak of that so for example if you have a driver you know who is a capricorn then he is going to wait his time he is going to do his best uh he will find he will he will go and he will try to become the driver of the ambani's or the highest person that he can find and you know what and sometimes things will happen to him that his his children will you know he will he will keep planning for his children also and uh 
even though and you know there are there are times where my dad has actually shown me that that driver's child will actually might go to medical school he'll work hard and then finally the driver has uh you know done such uh, uh such great service um and he has been so timely and everything and he is really the go to person for the boss that maybe the boss will be like okay you know what there is a seat here you can have it so they are very ambitious and they are ready to wait he might wait 20 years to get that favor um but uh, or or if he is a driver he will work towards being the head of the drivers union or uh you know creating the special infrastructure for uh you know uh, the systems of how this uh, uh you know how the uh, like a uber or something like how this whole organization of drivers works and of cars and so and you can see see that i am not a very capricorn person but they will go to the top you know if you have a a struggling actress she will slowly or eventually will reach to the pinnacle of that and whatever the status they start with they will go to a higher status in life uh and again uh that can be sometimes their shadow side that they can come across as status seeking they they can come across as as someone who is uh very focused on um you know on the materialistic uh another thing my dad used to say you know that all the capricorns when they are younger they look older and when they are older they start looking young, younger and this just a practical observation but also that they can be very serious when they are young because you know when other people are like ki what should i uh, you know uh they might be looking at many frivolous things but these people have their ambition and they want to get there so when they are younger they might come across as very serious but as they get, but when they get older you know they've had very regular habits they have uh you know not just partied hard and all they have been disciplined and all and that starts showing on them uh you know simone biles who's one of the greatest legendary gymnasts even though she had her big uh you know she had mental health issues in this olympics she was known as the goat because she would just like practice 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 she had a goal she to meet this goal like whenever she had a problem she had like a goal that she needed to meet see these are not the people who are going to charm you like a libra they're not going to like like a leo it's like look at me i'm here i have arrived they are not the philosophical uh uh the sagittarius but they have grit and now studies are showing that grit which is like your tenacity like the not the keeping on going at it um in the face of adversity you know that kind of grit is what leads to success and they have been teaching us even in parenting classes that this is what is needed it is not extraordinary talent but it is grit that uh, is the leading measure of success and boy do the capricorns have grit